Okay. So I bought this Beaver 108 Hydroponic Garden um, from Beaver.com. And I think it's going to be a great system. However, it is so difficult to put together, especially if you have a three-year-old running around you. So um, I decided to make this video because I put it together and then had to take it apart realizing I did it wrong. I highly, highly recommend that the first thing you do, because all of this comes apart, these pieces and these pieces will be apart in the box. So put these together because they're basically the same. The only thing that you have to change, and what I did as a reference is for my bottom piece, there's one that comes with this Viver sticker. You're gonna put one of the normal sides on, put one of these sides here, actually has two holes. And this was the part that I screwed up. I put this on the top instead of putting it on the bottom. So use this one as the beaver, with the beaver sticker as a like guideline to differentiate right from left when you're putting this together. So for my bottom piece, I have the beaver at the, when it's facing you would be the back, and then the left side is going to have the two holes like this. That will be your bottom piece. Then your middle one will have these with the holes where the plants go facing up, connecting holes on the bottom on all four sides. Same thing for the top piece. So when you're looking at your base, put the beaver sticker far from you. There's four short holes. The rest are long. These short ones are the ones that go on the bottom. They come with these caps. The left two tubes, put a cap in. And they're gonna go in these holes here. like that. You're going to want to pound them in with a mallet. That's the other thing. The mallet they send doesn't stay together. So as you're pounding away, it's flying off and hitting stuff in your house. Get your own mallet. The right side, you're only going to need one of these. And it's going to be the tube closest to you, furthest away from the beaver sticker. Put it in the top like this and you're going to want to put it in this hole. The back one doesn't get one of these little plugs. tubes come in. So for the left side, still having the beaver sticker furthest from you, it's going to be the back one. So the same line as the beaver sticker gets the plug. The one closest to you does not. For the right side, you're going to put the plug on the bottom. And put it on the line with the beaver sticker. So the first is one from you. The one closest to you doesn't get a plug. Oh, I'm sorry. It does. At the top. It's a plug at the top. So for the second level, this one has one at the bottom, this one has one at the top. This one has one at the top on the left-hand side, the one closest to you on the left 
doesn't have anything. And then you're gonna fit your second tier on. Two more long tubes. The ones on the left hand side, both of them get a plug at the top. hand side. So it's going to be the one closest to you that gets the plug at the top. The one farthest from you gets one at the bottom. And that's the one with the beaver sticker line. Okay, so I flipped it around so you can see from my viewpoint because I know it kind of mirrors things when you record. The beaver sticker was fe facing me furthest, the furthest pole from me, okay? And if you do it correctly, the spout goes here. You look at the top, you shouldn't be able to see past one level. This one you can see down to level two. One level. And under here is one level. Spout goes on. Now, if you happen to crack a tube, because you did this wrong and you had to take it apart like I did, they do send you one that goes for this drainage spout down here. That you can put in there however you're gonna have a bucket underneath there anyways so I just switched it out for the non-cracked one and it's still gonna drain hope this helps